Hey guys, welcome back to Grind Don't Sleep. Today we'll talk about how Ray Dalio accumulated this giant net worth. Let's head into it. Ray Dalio has been tremendously successful in business and finance, amassing a multi-billion pound fortune over his long career. His net worth is estimated by Bloomberg to be 12.26 billion pounds, making Dahlia the world's 119th richest person. He frequently shares his wisdom on a range of subjects concerning success in the business world on his Twitter account. Many widely used practices were first popularized by Dalio, leading him to be viewed as one of the finance realm's greatest innovators. In fact, he has even been called the Steve Jobs of investing by some. Time 100 listed Dalio as one of the 100 most influential people in the world in 2012, with Bloomberg Markets listing him as one of the 50 most influential people in 2011 and 2012. Dalio, 71, is originally from New York and studied at Harvard Business School. Dalio famously founded Bridgewater Associates out of his two-bedroom apartment in 1975, which was listed as the world's largest hedge fund in 2013. He hit rock bottom in 1982 when a bad bet wiped him out financially and he had to borrow $4,000 from his dad to rebuild his company from scratch. Between the years 1991 and 2005, the company only lost money in 3 out of the 14 calendar years. Since then, the Queen's New York native has amassed a net worth of $17 billion while building Bridgewater into the world's largest hedge fund which now manages roughly $150 billion in assets. Bridgewater Associates Investment Strategy Ray Dalio and Bridgewater have pioneered various investment strategies and even advised the US government on the adoption of inflation index bonds. Broadly speaking, Ray Dalio is a micro investor. That means he makes his investment based on a view about the economy. That is supposed to, for example, being a stock picker, like somebody who chooses companies to invest in. Though Dahlia stepped down as CEO of Bridgewater in 2017, he has remained chairman and co-chief investment officer. But Dahlia says he will eventually pass along those titles because now, at 71, he's focused on the next phase of his life, pursuing his passions and helping others succeed. His recent tweets focus on making decisions, some specifically in relation to careers. All of the principles have been posted on his social media before, but remain helpful reminders nonetheless. Favor Simplicity Dahlia's latest thread, posted August 10, urges followers to simplify how they think about their life and career. He urges followers to get rid of irrelevant details so that the essential things and the relationships between them stand out. He also pointed out that just because you can't do something naturally doesn't mean you can't do it. You just have to have creativity and determination. If necessary, you can seek the help of others. Shoots the great over the new. Dahlia also looked at the lens through which you should view a decision, like a short-term call. New is overvalued relative to great, he wrote. Dahlia said when making a simple decision, like which movie to watch or book to read, to consider whether you're drawn to proven classics or the newest thing. Your habits frame success. Dahlia's third principle, posted August 8, refers to habits. They define your success, so choose them wisely. If you do just about anything frequently enough over time, you will form a habit that will control you, he wrote. He said that good habits are those that get you to do what your upper level you wants, and bad habits are those that are controlled by your lower level you and stand in the way of getting what your upper level you wants. If you understand how this part of your brain works, you can form better habits, Dalio added. Radical transparency and personality tests are important. Among Dalio's many management principles is the concept of radical transparency, which encourages open and honest dialogue between colleagues and managers. Dahlia recently developed a Zoom app based on the concept, designed to enable people to give their colleagues instant feedback. Several members of Insider's careers desk gave Dots Collector a go and found that it was not for the faint of heart. While not everyone is convinced by their efficacy, Dahlia is also a proponent of personality assessments, believing they can be useful in helping a person identify and shape their strengths and weaknesses. He launched his own free-to-use assessment in April, after two years of development. What do you think about Ray Dahlia's advice? Would you invest in Bridgewater Associates? Let us know in the comment section. This brings us to the end of our video. I hope you enjoyed it. Hit like if you did, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel so that you don't miss any of our videos in the future. Also, watch the two videos that are on your screen because I'm sure you'll love them. With that, I'll see you in the next video.